Hi, welcome to Any More Nissan. My name is AJ Lauberg, and I'm here to introduce you the 2015 Nissan Juke. It comes in five different trim levels, the S, SV, SL, Nismo, and the Nismo RS. Let's go ahead and take a look at some differences between the 2014 and 2015. Upon first glance, you may not notice a lot of differences between the 2014 and the 2015 Nissan Juke, but when you take a closer look, you'll notice things such as the front LED boomerang headlights, the front and rear fascias, and of course, Nissan has offered a new stylish way to personalize your Juke, and they call it the Juke Color Studio. With the Juke Color Studio, it offers nine different color options and 12 accents, including your rear spoiler, your wheel center caps, your side door sills, 17-inch alloy wheels, and among other things, your front and rear bumpers. What this does is let you know that you have a unique, one-of-a-kind Juke. With the 2015 Nissan Juke, some standard options include your turn indicators on your side mirrors, intelligent key with push button start, and even a rear view camera. The Nissan Juke doesn't just stop with just the standard rear view camera. It also includes the all around view system, which allows for 360 coverage of the entire vehicle for crowded parking lots or even parallel parking. The Nissan Juke's SV and SL can come available or standard Nissan navigation system. It comes with a 5.8 touch screen, which allows for normal navigation controls. What's also great is it offers an AM and an FM stereo system, CD player, your apps, and of course, an auxiliary and USB connection. What's great about the center console, it also includes your icon system. This helps with climate controls, and also of course your D-mode system to watch your normal driving habits. The Nissan Juke has taken the center console controls and put some of them in your control, while still helping to maintain focus when you're driving. Some of those are standard, which you've come to expect, including the cruise control, but some of the other adjustments include adjustments for your presets for your radio or CD, volume control, and then of course streaming audio Bluetooth, which you can make and take phone calls, but also play some of your music such as Pandora through your smartphone and then through your center console. The 2015 Nissan Juke is a crossover that sits four comfortably and has rear folding seats that split 60-40, which allows for ample storage capacity. And underneath that storage capacity is a full size spare. The 2015 Nissan Juke comes standard with a 1.6 liter direct injected gasoline turbocharged engine. On average driving, your gas will come out to 28 to 29 miles per gallon, but it has a front wheel drive and all wheel drive capability as well. Now that you've had a chance to learn about the 2015 Nissan Juke, come on down and personalize it with the Juke Color Studio, located here at Andy Moore Nissan right here on Pike Plaza.